Hello, Karam. Hi, Joni. How are you? I am doing pretty good. How are you doing, young fella? <laughs> fine, fine. Good, good. Yeah, I mean, it's, we're, I don't know about you, but we're having, I think I might have said this to you before, but we're having a really mild winter. Yeah, mm. it's not much rain. We have not had much rain, and here we are in the middle of February already. Mm -hmm. And uh, so there's some snow on the mountains, but not like typical. We should have tons of snow on the mountains. <laughs> but anyways, other than that, I'm doing fine. But the good thing about that is I've been able to get caught up in my yard mm -hmm. with all kinds of work that I would not have probably been able to do as comfortably if it was really cold. <laughs> so, yes, yes. Anyways, other than that, I'm doing fine. What about you? Uh, I'm good. A little bit tired today. Worked a lot. Sure. Also, uh, took care of my baby and uh, with, my, with my family. Uh, okay. Just, just had dinner and now in front of you. Okay. All right. Okay. I'm going to send you a link. Hang on for a second here. Okay. And let me see which one that I want to do with you. Okay. Okay, now this is, uh, let me see if that one would be the best one to do or not. Well, let's, yeah, let's, let's go ahead and do this one. This is about Tokyo. Well, yeah, this is about Tokyo. And what has happened because of the Corona virus mm. and the marathon that they have in Tokyo. Hang on. Copy, paste. Okay, there you go. And what we can do is just go through this vocabulary and then read the article and then answer the questions. And when you read the article, just kind of try to remember some of the things because they're going to ask you some questions. Okay, let's open it. Oh, it's about Tokyo Marathon, I think. Yeah, yeah. Tokyo Marathon close to most runners due to virus fears. Okay. Let's go ahead and start with the vocabulary. Okay, vocabulary. Okay. Drastically. Good. The temperature dropped drastically last night. Okay. Uh, is it similar with dramatically? Yeah. Yeah, dramatically, drastically. Very, very similar in yes. terminology. Yeah. Okay. Uh, bar. The red card barred him from playing in the next game uh, to prevent a person from doing something. Ah, it's like banned yeah. or blocked. Yeah. Okay. Elite. Uh, only the elite can afford their own private yacht. Yes, I know the word elite. <laughs> okay. Yes. Exclusive. Yeah, exclusive. Yeah. Okay. Call off. To cancel something, uh, okay. The game was called off because of the weather. Hmm. Uh, I know this word. It's not a word. It's like idiom, mm -hmm. I think. Okay. Track and field. Jesse Owens is one of the most famous track and field athletes of all time. Hmm. A group of sports which involve running, jumping, and throwing. Ah. It's like decathlon. Yeah, kind of. You know, Jackie Decathlon. Owens. I don't know if he. I, I. I don't know exactly, but I don't know if he was a, a triathlon athlete. But he, I think he was a fast hundred yard dash, and mm -hmm. jumping, and just you know all of those different things. He was just really good. But years there, ago, a, there's a movie about him. Oh, okay. Uh, in, in, in my watch list, but I have never found a chance to watch. Uh, okay. It's okay. just uh, still in my hard drive, and 
if I find the time, I would like to. Okay, well, maybe this maybe this will inspire you to find you some time to watch it. <laughs> yes, maybe. The, the, the name of the movie is, I think, Race. Ah, uh, okay, cool. Okay, postpone. I know the meaning of postpone. Okay. The ceremony has been postponed due to heaven. So the new world, drastically, uh, and the bar. Yeah. When, when, yeah. I, when I hear bar, it's like... Yeah, you're uh, going to get some to drink. Yeah, you yes. think you think of going to get something to drink at a at a place, mm -hmm. liquor or something. Yes. They call it ah, yes. At the same time, I understand the block, the but the physical shape of a block. Oh, okay. It, it's, yeah. it's it's um, how can yeah. I say? it's a line you you have to pass. Yeah, yeah. Or you know parallel bars in Olympics. Yeah, yeah, parallel Olympics. bars. Yeah, see, yes. so that yeah, depending on how you use it in a sentence, it mm -hmm. can be used in a number of different ways, and the meaning could get lost if you're not aware of what the different meanings oh, are, okay. even though and, the spelling's the same. Okay, okay. And call off. This is new for me. The okay. meaning is new for me, of course. The others are okay, similar. Okay. Uh, article. article. Okay, let's read the article. Tokyo Marathon closed to most runners due to the, due to virus fears. On February 17, Tokyo Marathon organizers drastically reduced the number of participants for this year's race out of fear of the spread of the coronavirus coming from China. The general public is being barred from the race on March 1. It will now be limited to a few hundred elite participants. Organizers said in brief statement about 38,000 people were expected to take part in the marathon. Mm. The Tokyo Marathon 2020 will be held only for the marathon elites and the wheelchair elites, organizers said. The Tokyo Marathon is the city's annual race and should not be confused with the Olympic marathon that will take place during the 2020 Tokyo Games. Ah, okay. Those races are to be uh, to be held in the northern city of Sapporo. Sapporo. I don't know. Yeah, Sapporo is in northern uh, Japan, which usually during the winter time should have tons of snow. Hmm. But this year they have just like here they have had a very mild winter, and have not had the snow that they usually would typically have. Okay, the Tokyo Marathon is the la latest large sports event. Event, not even event. Event, yeah. Event to be affected by the virus, now named COVID nineteen by the World Health Organization, almost all sports events uh, in China over the next few months have been called off, cancelled. Cancelled. Okay, including next month's World Indoor Track and Field Championship and Formula One race in April. Okay, organizers of the Tokyo Olympics and the International Olympic Committee have said that they will not cancel or postpone the Games and are following advice from the AH, uh, WHO. I don't understand the meaning of the sentence. Okay. Uh, and are following advice from uh, yeah. WHO. The yeah. Advise them to cancel or not to advise? No, what they're, what they're doing right now, the World Health Organization is basically not saying you need to postpone the Olympics. Mm, okay. They uh, are okay. They are following advice from yes. WHO. Okay. Yeah. It, it, it's interesting because uh, that there sh if there if there should be an advice from WHO, so yep. uh, they should have asked them. Yeah, well, That's yeah. That's why they, I confused. In, yeah, in yeah, yeah. Well, they're 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 asking. They have probably asked the WHO. You know, mm -hmm. can we go on with the Olympics? And the and the WHO at this point is not giving them an answer. Mm -hmm. They're not saying no. You've got to stop the Olympics because it is mm -hmm. a few months away. And so yes. they're they're in kind of a limbo state. But they, at this point, they are still planning to go ahead with the Olympics. Okay, 
uh, let me continue. The Olympic Olympics open on July 24th with about 11,000 athletes participating. About 7.8 million tickets are available for Olympic events, which draw hundreds of thousands of tourists. The next Olympics, the 2022 Winter Games, will take place in Beijing. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, the spreading virus has already forced organizers to cancel World Cup ski racers this month in Yanquin, China. Is it is it written? Yeah, Yang Yang uh, Yang Quig Yang Quig Yang Quig China, which would have been test events or the Winter Olympics. A biathlon event in the Zhangjiakou has also been called off. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. Discussion. What are the thoughts on, on the decision to bar the public from taking part in Tokyo Marathon? Hmm? I don't understand the question. What are your thoughts? What are you thinking? Do you think it was a good decision or do you think it's a bad? Your thoughts are is asking you, what do you think? Okay. The world public from taking for me talking about it. I think uh, my idea is if it's asking the public of Tokyo, Tokyo people, mm -hmm. there is no need to uh, bar them not to take in a, take part in Tokyo Marathon. Uh, but if it's say public from everywhere, especially China, yeah. of course uh, they, sh they should be banned to be yeah. a part to participate in this marathon. Yeah, big but I think it's, it's asking uh, the to Tokyo uh, people because it's, yeah. it's a uh, public marathon. It's not an Olympic Games. So you don't need to be a professional athlete uh, to participate in this marathon. Right. I think but, it's asking the Tokyo people, so there's no need to bar them. Yeah, well, it's I I can understand their their thinking because usually at a big marathon, it's like the New York Marathon. Yes, yes. In Istanbul, they, we had we had same. Yeah, they draw people from all over the world, and especially the elite runners, the professional mm -hmm. runners. Mm -hmm. And so what they're basically saying that they know if they're going to have thirty eight thousand people. That's a lot of people, and all it would take is just one of those people that could be a spreader. They call them super spreaders of the coronavirus. Mm -hmm. If you know, and so I can understand because most of the elite runners, they're going to be coming from elsewhere around the world, probably. And yeah, so yes, that's but, what but uh, it's it's not necessary just uh, putting. Uh, how can I say? Uh, draw, draw, the draw, drawing borders, uh, especially yeah. about marathon. If you if you will, if you want to uh, take some precautions, uh, you should you should take it uh, for traveling or to entering the country or to outgoing the sure. country. It's not sure. about just only marathon. Okay, you ban people from the marathon, but right. if you let them inside the Japan, so the danger is continue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, and that's the thing. They have to make a decision. They base it upon, you know, all of the information that they have, even though I agree with you to a certain extent. I understand their reason for just saying, OK, only the elite athletes, the professional athletes, we're going to let them run. But the rest of you are going to have to stay home. Well, yeah. stay home or yeah. you cannot run but you can come to work yeah but yeah yeah, yeah. Uh, if, if you be even if you are on the street yeah you, you're, you're, you're you just, yeah. yeah you're still exposing yourself regardless so yeah. uh, if you would like to take a precaution cancel all organization yeah or um Build a uh, supervision system. Yeah, you wonder. System in yeah, the, in, in the in the country door, not yeah. uh, during during the marathon. 
Yeah, I, I kind of agree. I, I, th I, yeah, I think they should have just canceled the entire thing. That's what yeah. they should have done. You know, I yeah. think I think it probably gives a bad uh, representation mm -hmm. of why didn't they just cancel the entire thing instead of letting the elite runners come? Well, the elite runners come. There may be there may be rules. They must be part of some kind of a international grouping of uh, major marathons that they have to have a marathon regardless. So I don't know. Yeah. I agree. Yeah. Number two. Okay. Have you ever run a marathon? If so, please share your experience. If not, would you like to? Actually, uh, I run long distance uh, races, uh -huh. uh, but not a 42 kilometers marathon. Uh -huh. I, the, the maximum distance that I run was, I think, five kilometers. Yeah. Uh, 5,000 meters. And while I was a soldier, uh, I was be a part of a race uh, between uh, different, uh, how, I don't know the military term in English, uh, different uh, patrols or a base, different mm -hmm. bases. Be, uh, it's, it's between different bases, but we are all soldiers and mm -hmm. uh, we run 5,000 miles. And, uh, I had a pretty good degree because uh, I was over 30 years old when I was mm -hmm. in uh, military. Mm -hmm. So my my uh, degree is uh, was sorry my degree was so good when mm -hmm. you compare with the people at the age 20s. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, I'm still a good runner. Okay, good. You, even even I'm 41. Yeah, I'm a but walker. Mar marathon, marathon is uh, totally different. Yeah, 40, totally different. Yeah. 42 kilometers, it's so yeah. long. Yeah, I think the longest, uh, when I was in college, yeah, I, I think I ran like nine miles, which equals mm -hmm. to probably about 14, 15 kilometers. Yes. Yeah. I think yeah. it's semi-marathon. Semi yeah, yeah. That's about the longest I ever ran, yeah. Would you rather attend 2020 Tokyo Summer Olympics or the 2020 Beijing Winter Olympics? Why? <laughs> Actually, I'm planning to participate both of them. Ah. <laughs> so I can swim, I can run, I can dive, and I can ski also. Yeah, yeah. And uh, also, what, what was the name of the uh, skate? Bob, Bobcats, uh, can, can you remind me? Podcasts, uh, podcasts? No, 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 Bobcats. Uh, Bob. th there's, a, there's a vehicle uh, for, for athletes drive it in, in, in a snow, in an ice tunnel. Oh, uh, okay, you know? yeah, it's the luge, the luge, the luge, no? no, no, no. no? They're totally different. Bob, Bobcat, Bob, mm, something like that. Okay, is it in? Uh, I, will, I will remember. Okay. Win, is it the Winter Olympics? Winter Olympics, yes. Ah, okay. It must be a new, a new uh, event. Yeah. No, it's not so new. No. Okay. Well, send it to me. Yeah, I'm curious. Okay, yeah. I, 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 I will find in a, in a couple of minutes. Okay, let's okay. continue. Then I will okay. find. Okay. Uh, are most of the people you know concerned about the spread of the coronavirus? Sure. Actually, yes, I'm also uh, afraid of coronavirus because I have a baby. So uh, with my wife, sure. uh, we are uh, try to stay at home, not to go to public places. Uh, because in Turkey, there are so many Chinese people uh, coming for uh, tourism uh, reason and also sure. business reasons. So we have also people always visit China, uh, especially for, uh, for business purposes. So uh, there can be some dangerous points nowadays. Uh, we are trying to not, not to go uh, shopping malls or crowded places. Okay, now let me ask you a question, okay, about okay. this. What do, you, what do you think? Now, as my understanding as of right now, mm -hmm. Turkey, Turkey has nobody with the coronavirus, correct? From what you're hearing, 
yes. Yes. But it, yes. It, it, there, there are some suspicious, but not proved, and nobody died. Uh, okay. So, do you believe? Okay. This is this is one of those questions. Do you believe? Okay. Mm -hmm. Do you believe that there is none, or do you think uh, that the government might be trying to keep it under the wraps and they don't want? It? Uh, of course, this is not about believing or uh, unbelieving. If you are a logical guy, you have to be careful. Careful. Because you know, sure. uh, in Langley, uh, on the door, mm -hmm. uh, the first entrance, there is a sentence written. Uh -huh. uh, the headquarters CIA. Mm -hmm. Nothing seems like is it. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 So, okay. of course, you should be careful. And it's uh, also there is another theory that uh, some people created this virus just to affect Asian people. You know the virus SAR, S A R. Oh yeah. Like yeah. that. Yeah. Uh, because it was proved only affected Asian race people. Now I haven't heard that one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sar, sar virus. Yeah. Uh, it is. It is. It is. It is a chemical laboratory produced virus. And yeah. nowadays people talk about that the coronavirus is just to attack the Chinese economy. So all uh, victims are still, as I know, maybe true or not, just Chinese, just mm -hmm. uh, Asian people, Asian race people. Okay, yeah, everybody, I mean, there are there are other people of other races that have contracted it, but I don't know who has died, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's so interesting, yeah, it's another one of those mini theories, yeah. <laughs> okay, number four, further discussion. Okay, are most of the people, you know, concerned about, uh, we told about it, number five. Is China a popular tourist destination for people from your country? Actually, yes, but uh, I think 10% people who visited China to go there for tourism. 90% mm -hmm. of people business. visit uh, for business. Okay. But it's so popular for my country because uh, we are buying so many products from China, especially in my business. We buy uh, all our air condition systems from Chinese companies. Ah, okay. Okay. Further discussion. Well, has your country hosted any major sporting events in recent years? Yes, and this year also we will have, uh, I think on May, the Champions League final. Yeah. Uh, in Istanbul. And uh, last year we had Super Cup final. And in 2002, as I remember, we had also Champions League final. And uh, this year, we had uh, Women's Volleyball World Championship ah, in Turkey. Cool. It is very important because Turkey, uh, Turkey's position is very important in Women's Volleyball. We are in the number top three, one of the top three countries yeah. in the world. It's usually, usually America, Brazil, and probably Turkey. And, Turkey. Yeah. Uh, yes. Sometimes Ser Serbia. For okay. example, Serbia won the championship. Uh, we lost uh, in the final. Uh, and third place was, I think, United States or uh, Poland. I, oh. I'm not sure. I'm Interesting. not sure. Interesting. Uh, maybe Germany. I'm not sure. But... Uh, Turkey is, Turkey's women's volleyball team, national team is very important. Yeah, very good. Okay. Okay. What's the most exciting sporting event you have ever been to? Hmm. Oh. Uh, I think, yes, uh, I went so many games, but the uh, during the Champions League uh, quarterfinal, uh, I went to a game between Galatasaray versus Real Madrid. In Istanbul, and uh, it it was very important for me mm -hmm. uh, because we won against Real Madrid, and uh, we were eliminated. The score was not enough to pass the uh, tour, 
But uh, we saw all Real Madrid players and the coach, uh, the famous coach in the world, Jose Mourinho, mm -hmm. uh, with a white face. <laughs> if, if we have five or ten more minutes, uh, probably we will score one more goal and to pass the tour. Ah. <laughs> yes. Uh, it, was, it was very, very, very important moment for my life in my life. Okay, do you think you would find it more fun to watch Formula One race or World Cup ski races? Why? Mm -hmm. Formula One. Yeah, I used to be a fan of Formula One uh, twenty years ago, maybe or maybe twenty-five years ago. Yeah. But uh, after Ayrton Senna died, um, I stopped watching. Mm -hmm. Time by time, I watched some races, but uh, not uh, not not feel the same in yeah. two mm -hmm. So uh, nowadays, uh, e even on TV, Formula One races are yeah. not published. Yeah, yeah, they're not. Formula One, for some reason, at least in America, Formula One, when I was growing up, was really, really popular and really famous. But it's not as popular in American races. It's the regular race car drivers, Daytona 500, those, mm -hmm. uh, the stock type of racing cars, not the big, fancy, low-profiled engines. They're not, it's just uh, not yeah, as popular. Yeah, yeah. United States is uh, totally separated from the world. Yeah, right, about this kind of events, they sure. have, they have their own organizer organizations. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, even NBA is a basketball, okay, but totally different style. Yeah, yeah. Uh, NASCAR, Daytona 500. Right. Uh, they 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 have different their own organizations. Sure. Uh, also, National Football League, totally yeah. different sports. Yeah, yeah. Um, so uh, when we are talking about, especially sports, United right. States are totally out of this world. Yeah, they're in a, they're in a different league on certain things. But when it comes to soccer, the rest of the world, it's soccer and football. Uh, rest of the world, maybe it's Formula One. If Formula One outside of the U.S. is is I think yes. very very it's popular. Very popular. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and so it just especially depends. Especially in Europe. On, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, and that's why they were saying the Formula One in Beijing. I think they held it every year in Shanghai, actually, or Beijing, Beijing. one or the Beijing. other. I can't remember. Beijing, yeah. I think. Yeah, interesting. Now this year it was postponed. Can't postpone. It, well, it, 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 it's in the article also. Yeah. In the article, I know. Okay, World Cup ski races. No, I never watched ski races after uh, Alberto Tombo retired from skiing and mm. Herman Meyer also. Mm -hmm. My age is... Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that tells you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. So, it, it, and also nowadays it's not so popular to publish on TV Winter Olympics. Uh, 25 years ago it was so popular. Oh, All yeah. Olympic Games were published on TV and there is not so uh, much options to watch. So everybody in the family, uh, when you open the TV, there are one or maximum two channels. One of these, uh, one of them, uh, were publishing Olympics. Sure. So we all watch games and we had some information, ideas about athleticism, skiing, even winter games are not so popular in my country. Yeah. But now, just everybody focused on soccer. So. Yeah, yeah, there's just, there's so many distractions, other distractions yes. nowadays when uh, years ago, there wasn't that many distractions. Now you have so many distractions. You've got the computers, you've got mobile phones, you've got, I mean, just everything is just so, so vastly different now. Well, I, I remember when I was a child, my mother and I always tried to watch ice skating and, oh yeah, uh, we were fun of Katarina Witt. Oh, okay, and yeah. Now ask me, uh, have you ever watched uh, ice skating show in last twenty five years? Even maybe not 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 more than one minute. 
Yeah. <laughs> Just, just uh, passing with remote controller. If I saw something <laughs> yeah. on the screen, that's all. Yeah, the instant, the instant, the instant. Uh, yeah, watching whatever you want. Anyways, good, good to see you, Graham. Have a good one, buddy. Yes. Okay. Bye bye.